Hey guys, Deju22 here, and I cannot believe that Eve has screwed Becca out of the championship. And Becca was champion for close to a year, at 11 months, but it's just a shame that it ended the way that it did. But at least Eve will keep her job. tell you what Bowser is a beast but uh, he is gonna have to take on this man the former intercontinental champion for rock Obama and I'll tell you what, ever since Obama lost the championship, uh, Daniel Bryan, who was previously prohibited from getting another title shot uh, at the Intercontinental Championship, well, now that uh, Obama has lost the championship, uh, that ban has been lifted. But if Obama does not win this championship back, he may never get another chance at it. In fact, I would have to think that this would be the final opportunity for him. Obama is going to have a fight on his hands, especially with Bowser, and it is and it is for the Intercontinental Championship. Forgive me if I'm a little rusty, but I, anyways, uh, in case you didn't know, or in case you're joining us right now, uh, this is day two of SummerSlam, and we bring this live to you in Atlantic City, in Trump Plaza, and if, if you didn't know, I'm pretty sure some of you didn't know that the majority of the audience are the families that have lost their homes, and the tickets have been bought by uh, the generous donations of the Red Cross, as well as from the top 1%. So they've contributed to buying the tickets, and we ended up raffling them to the families that won them, not just for day one, but for day two as well. As for the luxury boxes, and... Sorry about that. As for the luxury boxes, uh, they were bought out by the 1% who wanted to see the show as well. So... Yeah, I was so upset that Eve won... Uh, the championship unfairly mind you but uh, there were times uh, during that matchup that wow I cannot believe Obama had the strength to do that to Bowser but anyways uh, I, I was I mean there were times that Becca should have had the match won and she should have went for the cover but she wanted to inflict a lot of punishment to Eve that she took her time and took up too much time and it came back to Hunter, and now Eve is the new women's champion. And and as for what's going to happen afterwards, I'm not going to. I'm not sure, but we'll find out uh, as the weeks go on, uh, going into Night of Champions. And a Samoan drop on a Bowser. I don't know where Obama gets the strength to do it, but he does. I mean, he just did it. Uh-oh, wait a minute. A karate chop right to the head. 
of Barack Obama. And now he picks up Obama. And now what's Bowser going to do? And a whip in the corner, and what's this? A rebound German suplex onto Obama. I mean, Obama's going to have to think of something, and he's got to do something quick, because at the rate this is going, Bowser's going to put this one away. And this is going to be a last man standing match, so... This is, this is a match where if you lose, there is no excuse. But yeah, it was really it was really nice of the Red Cross Foundation as well as uh, the top one percent for donating uh, to not only buy the tickets but also help the families relocate as well as uh, bring in some workers from out of state uh, to help rebuild New Jersey, uh, the state of New Jersey, as well as parts of New York and, and parts of Virginia. Although Virginia is not as in bad shape as I thought it was going to be, but New Jersey took it worse. So we'll find a, we'll find a way to uh, get them back on track. But in the meantime, Obama is in a fight with Bowser, and Bowser cannot try, or I should say, Obama cannot get in a match. Can't match up strength with Bowser. You just can't do it as Bowser's just wailing away on him. And a butterfly stretch, but you cannot win by submission, however. As, yeah, Bowser escapes. And some back elbows on to Bowser. And an, and an elbow right to the head. Uh, I'm just going to move a little closer here. And an elbow right to Obama once again. I should also remind you that there is no time limit, so someone is going to win and someone is going to lose. It's a matter of who it is that's going to win. A chin lock on a Bowser, but you cannot win by submission. You have to, you, you gotta knock him down and keep him down for the count of ten. And Bowser, uh oh, just pounding on the back, just pounding away on him. And down goes Obama. And an arm smash. And a whip into the corner goes Obama. And an elbow to Bowser. And a couple of right hands, but Bowser takes control. Inverted suplex on to Obama. And Obama's hurting still. Goes for an elbow, but gets a hip toss for his trouble. Then a kick to the leg of Bowser. And now he... Wow! Look at the strength. But Bowser counters into a DDT. And a couple of right hands on to Obama. But he picks him up, however. And a drop to hold face buster on to Bowser. And a spine buster. And now, wait, what's he doing? An ankle lock onto uh, Obama. And now he's just torquing the leg, trying to keep uh, Obama from even getting up. A full Nelson, but you can't win by submission, however. And Obama somehow escaped. And went for a clothesline, but ended up getting the turnbuckle. And uh oh, wait a minute. A shoulder breaker. I'm surprised uh, 
Obama had the strength to pick him up there. And wait a minute. Obamination! Obamination! I'm surprised he was able to pick up Bowser and just powerbomb him. Wait, what's going to happen here? Wait a minute. Barack bottom. Barack bottom onto Bowser, and now Bowser's down for the count. I cannot believe this, folks. After a, after an abomination and a Barack bottom to Bowser, the winner, and once again, the Intercontinental Champion, Barack Obama. I cannot believe this. Barack, uh, he was he was up against a monster, literally, in Bowser, and he has won back the Intercontinental Championship and his champion for the third time in his career. Give it up to Obama. Give it up to the President of the United States. And stay tuned for the next match. That'll be coming up right after this.